Hey everybody, today we're gonna to do a quick demonstration on how to sync your recipes from your Thea app to the Echo Air. Biggest thing to remember, go to the Play Store or the App Store, download 2.04, make sure you have the newest app, and you have to log in once in your app with your Google protocol, with your Google login. That's the only way it'll sync today. Eventually Apple will work, but for you beta testers, that's the only way to get your recipes synced across the platforms. All right, so, now that you've done that, it's time to go look at the Echo. All right, let's get started. So you've already signed into your app. Now let's go sign into the Echo Air. You can see the four, three groups that we set up yesterday. Real quick, we're just gonna go in and look and you see there's no recipes here. So we can add a recipe, we'll make it new, just so we have something to look at, save it. I don't wanna add anything right now, but we'll go back to all recipes. So now you can see it's here but there's still nothing else. So this is how recipes will show up. Let's go back home, go up to the zone level, and now go to the configuration menu. Go in here, scroll down, and you've got our Thea app recipe import. Go ahead and click on it. Once it stops spinning, you should be good. All this is doing is linking login. So you're linking your login here with your Thea app login. Go to recipes, and there's all of the recipes that you've made over the years. So it's all there, plus the new one I just made. Now, one thing as of right now with beta, you cannot go from the app or from the Echo to the app. So all you can do is pull recipes out of the app. If you want a new recipe in your app, you got to go back and make it. One other cool thing I just showed you is that your recipes go across all the zones. So you can make a recipe for a kale, and it's going to be good in anything. Hope you guys enjoy it. We'll talk to you later.